said it's your girl chocolate swag welcome back to my channel i have been gone for such a long time and it is time for your selfish sunday message nope can't do it can't do it all right y'all let's be real can't do it i don't even know what is happening but i feel like crap today which is surprising because the other day I was super excited. Like yesterday was Halloween. I didn't do anything at all. But I was super excited because it was 27 days away from my birthday. I had a countdown going on ever since um, October 27th. It was one month from my birthday. So every day from October 27th, I was like, one month till my birthday. No, I was saying 30 days till 29. Then I was saying 29 days till 29, 28 till, days till 29, so on and so forth. So today I expected to be super excited because today is November 1st. It is 26 days until I turn 29 on November 27th. I had this plan in my head that I was going to make a mini bucket list of 29 things I wanted to do before I turned 29. I had this plan that I was going to upload a video every day until my birthday. I wanted to do like a photo shoot. It was all these things I wanted to do. And then I was just laying in bed and I was like, I'm not doing nothing today. Like I'm not even barely paying attention to the TV. I was supposed to work out today. I didn't want to work out. I just don't want to do anything. And that's where this video um really came about because i was going to get on here and give y'all some motivational be selfish type of speech and i had put my wig on so i wouldn't look a mess because i look a mess i ain't gonna lie like let's zoom in let's see how bad i look so been eating too much candy so my face is breaking out um i have bags designer bags you know they cost a lot so Okay, psych, <laughs> I have eye bags and they're not as bad, I guess, as they could be, but I'm not satisfied with how under my eye looks. I do have a product that I need to be using on there that I actually created myself and I'm not even using it. I am washing my face. No, nah, I'm lying. I'm not washing my face. Okay, scratch that. I wasn't watching my washing my face, but today I did wash my face. And while I was watching my face, I said I need to make a video and I need to just come on here real raw and you know, just be real with you guys. I have not been myself. Look at my wig in the background. Lord have mercy. I have not been myself lately. I've had moments where I've been really up in a few moments where I'm just like blah. So that's where I'm at right now. I'm feeling like blah today. That's why I got on this robe, I got on this scarf. I look a mess, my face is breaking out. I've been eating too much candy. Um, it's not as bad as it could be. My eyebrows look a mess, my nails are not painted. I don't have any nails on and I, I, I make nails. I'm always making nails. I love to do that for other people, for myself, just in general. My nails is butt naked, like naked naked. They look crazy. So you can tell I'm not myself. My feet not even painted, like what is going on? But, and I'm rambling. So something is definitely wrong. I'm always rambling, I'm lying. But <laughs> let me try and focus, which I'm having a hard time doing right now. The point of this video is that I wanted to tell you guys, while I was washing my face, I decided that it is important that I take care of myself. Like I always knew that I needed to, so I don't wanna say I decided while I was washing my face, like I just was like, bing, I gotta take care of myself. But I just realized it more so today than um, any other day last week or the week before when I've been feeling like out of it or down, I just kind of slept it off or just was lazy. And this is what I want to say to you. It's okay to be lazy sometimes. It's okay to not be okay sometimes. It's okay to just check out for a little bit. It's okay to just do nothing. But it can also um, make you feel worse if you stay in that stage too long. Like, okay, take a day or two or three and do nothing. 
if you really need it do nothing for a week i wouldn't advise it because after a couple of days you just really start to feel even more down and even more grumpy and even more sad and cranky is because like you're just not doing anything so definitely listen to your body if you need it then go for it but after you take a day or two or three try to regroup even if it's something small try to do something that's going to make you feel better like today i'm not me i'm not put together i'm just bumming it all day and then i sat there and i started to feel worse and i started to feel sleepy and annoyed and agitated and i was like okay i'm going to do two things i'm going to wash my face i'm going to take my vitamins i'm going to make my cup of water that was more than two things but those three things washing my face taking my vitamins and drinking my cup of water those three things are like group one out of two so that was like the group of things that i did and then the second thing that i did was i actually did a very 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 minimal workout when i tell you i did 10 crunches 10 sit-ups 10 jumping jacks 10 push-ups and 10 squats that's really all i could do like i couldn't muster up my regular routine or my 30 to 40 minute workout or 15 i couldn't do none of that it probably took me five minutes or less to do 10 push-ups 10 sit-ups 10 crunches 10 jumping jacks and 10 squats and i just did not have it in me to do nothing else so basically all this rambling leads to if you don't do anything else um Take care of yourself. There's going to be days when you check out. There's going to be days when you just can't with the world. But take a day or two or three. Regroup. Get back on your feet. And if you don't do anything else, drink water, wash your face, and take your vitamins. And let that be a start. Because I did that today, and I feel a little bit better. That's how I ended up making this video. Because earlier, you couldn't even pay me a million dollars to make a video i wasn't doing nothing earlier but um after i washed my face and i drank my water and i did that um quick mini workout and i took my vitamins i felt a little bit better now i'm still gonna bum it for the rest of the day i'm not even lying to you i'm not doing nothing else today well i am gonna probably cook dinner but Besides making sure that I eat, not doing nothing else. I just, I'm checking out for today. But you have to take care of yourself. You have to know when you're not okay. Let it sink in, feel it, deal with it, and then get back on your feet. So take your moment to just check out however long you feel that may be. I would advise you not to let it be too long unless your body is just like you're just over exhausted and you need a week fine but for me if i'm not exhausted if i'm only just emotionally or mentally drained but not physically drained a week will be too long because then the longer i'm in that um lazy bummy i feel crummy i feel bad space it just gets worse so i know that i can't be in that space too long eventually i have to pull myself together but i don't even think any of this makes any sense because my thoughts are everywhere like how i look right now like a bum like a mess you know it's how i feel on the inside today i, I don't always feel that way but today something is just happening and i'm just feeling like crap i mean it could be on flow. She did visit. I think I'm on day three out of her five to seven day vacation. So she'll be leaving soon. So maybe that has something to do with it. If you don't know who Aunt Flo is, um, Google it. She's the aunt that you don't want to come visit because she comes bearing the kinds of gifts that you don't want. The kinds of gifts that give you headaches, make you eat too much, make you bloated, make you can't fit your outfits, make you cranky. It's your period, people. Your period. If you didn't know, your period. Okay? It's here. It's annoying. And I feel like crap. I'm agitated. I look a mess. And I'm rambling. So it's time for me in this video. Hopefully, you know, I can pull myself together for tomorrow because, you know, it will be 25 days until my 29th birthday. And I just want to try and 
just do a whole bunch of things, even if they're super small, that make me happy, that make me feel good inside, that make me excited. I just want to enjoy my last couple of weeks of being 28 and transition over into 29 beautifully. So that is my goal. Hopefully I can pull myself together tomorrow. But for the rest of the day, I'm not doing anything. So I'm going to shut up. I'm going to leave you with this message. Take care of yourself. Know that it is okay to check out. Know that it is okay to have a bad day. Know that it is okay to have an off moment. But don't let it last too long. Get back on your feet. If you don't do anything else, drink your water. Take your vitamins and wash your face. I know it sounds dumb, but it really made me feel better. Like, it really did. So if you don't do anything else, drink your water, take your vitamins, wash your face. And this too shall pass. Whenever you get in a moment when you're in a rut and you just feel like, Ugh, just know that you've been there before. You've been in worse positions before and you've been in better positions before. So it's going to pass and it'll be over soon. And then also speak to someone if you need to professionally or just family member. If you're feeling that down or if you just you need to get things off your chest, talk to someone, read a book. If you're religious, read some religious material, cry, just do something to get those feelings off of you and then move forward. So for me, I washed my face. I took my vitamins. I drank some water. I read a devotion. Shout out to my sister Star for sending me that book. I read um, a piece out of that devotion book that she sent me. And then I did that very, very, very quick workout. I didn't record it because I didn't even plan to do it. I was just walking through the kitchen and I just dropped down and did it real quick to just get it over with while it was like on my mind. I was like, let me do this before I don't kind of thing. But, you know, those are some of the things I did today to try to boost uh, my mood. But right now, I'm about to end this video, get back into bed and just let myself check out for the rest of the day. And I'm going to try to come back stronger tomorrow and have a, a, a more upbeat day. It could also be the weather too. Like it is very cold and gloomy here today. It just sucks. So, this probably won't make any sense at all, but if you made it through this video, thank you. Thank you so much. You have survived my rambling. You deserve a trophy. <laughs> and I'll see you guys soon. All right. Bye-bye.